Cumulative current on power transmission lines will lead to power transmission line sag. Earthquakes and heavy rainfall often occur in Taiwan, and this may lead to emergency events in Taiwan's power supply. Thai Power sends out a large number of workers to the field to complete power line maintenance tasks. Nowadays, the entire length of the extra high voltage power transmission lines in Taiwan is about 3,300 kilometers. Through an intelligent extra high voltage power grid safety monitoring system, the maintenance personnel can obtain power grid information in real time. The intelligent extra high voltage power grid safety monitoring system combines wireless sensor network with information communication technology. In this system, intelligent sensors are placed on power transmission lines. The sensor includes multiple induction coils, equipped with a backup function, and a chargeable battery, which can work a long time. The sensing circuit allows the sensors to monitor power transmission lines in real time. The system is equipped with an infrared temperature sensor, a three-axis accelerator, a temperature sensor, a humidity sensor, and an illumination sensor. Through these sensors, the system can monitor the conductor temperature of power lines. After the intelligent sensor conducts a sensing task, it transmits the sensing data to a gateway installed on the tower. The gateway uses a low power consumption embedded system as the computing platform. It also includes an industrial long distance Wi-Fi module, so each tower can communicate with each other to form a backbone communication network. Moreover, a weather station is added to the gateway to measure microclimate parameters around the tower. The gateway uses a solar panel with a lead acid battery as the power source for long-term monitoring. Our research team designs a mesh forming mechanism for the backbone communication network. If any tower breaks down, the data can be sent back through other towers. Thus, power line monitoring data will not be lost. The system also includes a user-friendly visualized GUI. The interface provides both the real-time sensing data and the Central Weather Bureau weather forecasting data. Through the PCR algorithm, the system can forecast the conductor temperature of the extra high power transmission lines every 12 hours, and it can also estimate current margins based on the power transmission line's temperature. In summary, this system provides accurate and real-time surveillance for extra high voltage power lines, which can benefit Taiwan greatly.